Good day. Uh, my name is Juan Zarate. I'm studying um, the English course for B2 level. Um, my CEAD are CIPACURA and um, taking the class on CIPACURA. Um, also, we have to develop for the last activity um, to choose between uh, three options of short films. Uh, the first one was sight, the second one was study, and the third one was black hole. I choose um, the short film sight. Uh, why? Because it's a uh, um, science fiction uh, short film that shows um, the last things about uh, the applications and implications that has the connectivity uh, among others and among all the people. Um, that's uh, the last step to connectivity that we're, we've been chasing for years and also to interact and, and to bend uh, with uh, those um, intelligence, artificial, artificial intelligence and to interact uh, as a common thing to others and, and nowadays we just saw that all, all the activities it depends on uh, many applications and not only to enhance our life it's also to improve our uh, measurements and uh, to connection and all of that um, we have to um, answer uh, some questions but first I have to mention uh, from what what's it all, what it's all about um, these um, short film um, shows uh, a near future uh, where all the application were bent on uh, glass glasses land um, islands um, not far from the Google lens that um, actually were developed and um, it's just so bent on the common activities um, in the short film that um, shows a normal interaction between a date, uh, you know, a blind date, between two persons and how it's very, very uh, bent and how it can control these application and these um, thing, this device, it, it um, controlled all of um, its mind at the end of the short film. We have to answer that question, so I'm going to move fast over these ones because I need to get in touch with that. And the first one is, would you like to have sight uh, for the inter interactions and all the applications that could uh, benefit um, the, um, the today activities? Would be a great uh, device. And the f second one, what would you use sight for? I think to translate um, languages, also to translate signs, uh, to interact with maps, uh, to navigate uh, among the city, also to be aware about the dangers and all the um, currently news about it. It's very helpful and useful uh, about it. Um, the third one, how could site be misused as it shows in the in the short film, it was very much used to um, depend and, and to interact with the other people and to control them. I guess it's not far from the um, nowadays because um, social media controls the minds and the thoughts of all, all the people. Um, you know, as a um, technical issue, we could uh, move um, his thought his thoughts on other possibilities and other activities um, to benefit or to aware about it, to benefit some specific uh, persons, um, political media, political groups and religious groups and to move uh, its feelings and its interactions as someone says long time before. Um, the people were small to put the crowd it's very naive and very mellow male. so it could be be misused and the wrong hands 
Do you think a device like Sight is possible in the future? I guess it, nowadays we have some sort of uh, device that it's Google Lens and uh, could be improved and we reduce his, its size to contact lens and could be, could be. It's very, very possible the, to um, near in the future um, and to have this kind of device and how could using sight change people's lives I guess for great reasons it could benefit and um, uh, you know uh, main activities as control um, disease control interaction psychology to scan uh, its interaction and its feelings uh, in a good way you know uh, psychologically could and control all the media and all the thoughts based on what we see, what we see. So it could be very, very, very interesting to be benefit to all the people in your right hands. And um, that's the video we're looking for. And I hope you can um, be satisfied with all the explanations and all the answers that I already give to you. Uh, have a good day and see you.